Hi guys, this is Jason here from the Nathaniel School of Music. I teach piano at the school. And in this short lesson, which I plan to divide into two parts, the first part, well, both parts essentially focus on how to make a simple arpeggio pattern more folksy or folkish. Uh, I don't know what the right word is, but you get the idea to, to sound like a folk song. Okay, so the first technique involves you playing the arpeggio with your left hand and jamming with the right hand. The second technique is a flip where the right hand does the arpeggio and the left hand creates the folk effect. So both arpeggio hands are going to play something you probably already know, right? So if I take, let's say, a D major chord in my left hand, right? I'm sure you've used this pattern a lot. And so on. It's a very nice pattern. But in a song where there's already a singer and you don't need to play a melody line per se, you can... <clears throat> Use your right hand and literally any finger, any note in the, in the di diatonic to the key and get this sort of an effect. Keep the chord going. So the way I'm counting this is if these are eighth notes, if you don't know what an eighth note is, even that is fine. Just count with me. One and two and three and four and. So the and essentially divides the beat by two. One and two and three and four and. However, I can also divide the beat by four, right? For example, one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one E and a two E. So, on. so the E's and the U's or the 25% division of the beat and the 75% division of the beat could be implemented or could be captured in the right hand because it's not being captured in the left hand. The left hand is playing eighth notes, straight eighth notes. So if I count 16's, 1E and 2E and let me get the U's, 1E and You don't have to do it all the time. Actually, even all the time sounds cool. But perhaps you can let it go for beat two. Uh, hit the U uh of the one and hit the U uh of the three. Let me count it with you. One E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a, right. feel and you can add your right hand creativity alongside this groove change the chord popular songs as well or any such thing. I mean, this is just a trick to, to just get anything to sound a bit more folkish and um, yeah, or, or a bit more Eastern. Well, not entirely Eastern. This could even be like a bluegrass song. So artists to listen to, you should definitely listen to this band Bela Fleck and the Fleck Tones. He's an incredible banjo player and I think this entire technique is influenced by that band and uh, his style of playing. And listen to their songs and uh, watch their stuff on YouTube. And another band which you can check out is Mumford and Sons which also has that, um, that bluegrass kind of feel. And 
You can also listen to some of my songs. There's, I'll put a link up in the comments. It's called The Sun Rises in the Autumn Sky. So that's a song which pretty much has the same pattern. And I keep using the same pattern uh, and uh, in, a, in a lot of my music. So again, let's see the pattern once more. Take uh, an arpeggio. Low note, high note, middle note, high note. That's the pattern. L, H, M, H. Perhaps hold the L with the pinky. And find the A, uh, one E and a two E. Don't hit all the ears. So you could also focus on the E's. I think the ers are more popular. The bands I suggested are all pretty much on the ers of the beat. I don't see why you can't use the E. It has the same vibe. Okay, and in the next short uh, lesson, we're going to talk about the other way around, where the right hand will be playing the same, a similar arpeggio, and the left hand is going to groove on the E and the ER, which I'm sure you already pretty much know, but we'll try and do it with a swing groove. So it's a little bit different for you guys when you practice, right? Again, this is Jason here from Nathaniel School of Music. And if you like the lesson, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and enable notifications, which is that bell button for a lot more lessons coming your way. And do share our videos with your friends as well. Cheers. Mm -hmm.